Welcome to another Family Clips unboxing. Uh, it has been a wild ride, probably one of the craziest unboxings we have ever done. Yeah, and you're gonna wanna watch it to the end because just when we didn't think that it could get any crazier, it got crazy. Hi there, my name is Joe. And I'm Jessica. We are homeschooling, natural living entrepreneurs. This is a story of how we balance it all for the freedom to live our lives devoted to our family and faith. Thanks for stopping by, subscribe, and come on in. Hello, and welcome to another episode of the Family Clips Unboxing. Today, we have here our hosts, Joseph and Jessica, and today we're going to practice our ninja fighting skills. We're not at all. We're going to open up these boxes, Jessica. With our ninja unboxing skills. Babe, you don't even feel good when you handle my sword. I know. I got a different unbox. And different then you lost it. It's right there. Okay. Anyway, this is an Amazon over pack pallet. Yeah, it's packed full of customer returns. <laughs> we paid $525 for it from Wholesale Logistics. <laughs> it's our fourth pallet. They've been making money for us, so let's get into it. <laughs> Did you see that ninja? What is wrong Did you see that, that ninja strike? Well, what is wrong Mama with you? Chow. Oh, God. Are we ready? Sure. I'm going to do this one, okay? All right. Because it's small and scary. Yeah. It's scary because look at the... <laughs> <laughs> and there are links uh, down in the description to the different uh, locations that Wholesale Logistics has. They operate like four states, Nebraska, uh, Omaha, Kansas Nebraska, City. Kansas City, Missouri, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, and Des Moines, Iowa, Des Moines, Iowa. Um, lots of people, you know, you corrected me on how I said Des Moines. Uh, I like Des Moines better, so that's what we're going to keep calling it, Des Moines. I also like to call Arkansas, Arkansas. Yeah. But, um... I got a better box cut opener this time. This is plastic. <laughs> so I feel a lot better. Do you, did this one scare you? Well, I just didn't want to cut product. Okay. But this won't cut product. No, it will not. This, my friends, is... What is going on with you today? I, don't, I think I had an energy drink and it's just really hitting okay. me right now. <laughs> a shelf. These are shelves. Yeah. Three, a shelf, a set of three <laughs> floating shelves. But you know what's funny? There's like you're all jacked up. I know. I'm so <laughs> I am so excited. Um, these have no. There's nothing. No, we might ever get ten dollars out front. Moving on. <laughs> we have a pizz plus. No, that's a pizza. A pizza ass plus. <laughs> no, it's a no. What is it? Pizzazz. Pizzazz. P oh, pizzazz. <laughs> I'm reading pizza. So pizzas. It's a plus. pizzas plus. Well, it's got a UPC once you scan it. Okay. <laughs> I'll do it. The beginning of this unboxing video. <laughs> I don't know if it feels really weird for you guys, but I'm feeling a little awkward right now. I will tell you. Why? <laughs> Am I awkward? No, not awkward. Uh, I don't think that's the word. I'm, you know. What is this? Presto pizzazz plus? <laughs> yes, that one. <laughs> <laughs> Let's look at all the buying options. Is it used? Yes. It is used. Brand yeah. new. These are selling for sixty-eight fifty-eight on the Amazons. How used? Like very used? I mean, it's not very used. I mean, it's got like some cheese residue Ew. on the back back there where they burnt it. Uh, it's missing the dial right there. Uh, and it smells like, uh, you know how electronics smell like where they're like burnt up? That's what it smells like. Well, they're selling, there's one listed for uh, $24.99 plus $17 shipping in pre-owned condition, which is weird to me. Is this supposed to come with a tray? It is, but the tray is gone. Oh, uh, well, we're probably not going to get mo yeah. more than 10 bucks off of this then. Yeah, I don't even know. We're going to say $0 because it doesn't smell right. Like, it smells like it's burnt up. What was your question? Can I do the big mysterious box? I mean, that box says, yes, you can. <laughs> yes, I can. 
But how? Do I move it? What is the best way to facilitate the opening of the box? This way. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm in a good mood, y'all. It's a good day to do an unboxing. <laughs> Maybe we need to do more on Mondays instead of doing them on Fridays where she's pooped. <laughs> and it's a mat? A mattress? A mattress? No, it's not a mattress. It is a... There's other stuff in the box, which is kind of neat. <laughs> it's a dog bed! <laughs> I think this is the original box that it came in, though. Uh, I guess they rolled it up. Life. Well, you know, I don't oh, see God. any dog hair on this. Yeah. So, let me check my eBay store. Nothing. And there's nothing. Yeah. But, you know, the average bed like this, brand new, is probably like 50 bucks. Yeah. So, if we can get like 20 bucks. Yeah. I will say, I have had a hard time trying to sell these on eBay because uh, you can't describe it as orthopedic or anything like that. Uh, so, we're going to try and sell on eBay. If we can get 30 bucks for it, then I'd be good. Not on eBay. Facebook. Facebook. The Facebook. This looks like uh, car seats. Uh, not car seats, <laughs> car seat covers. Oh, is what it looks like. I, we don't know exactly what these are. We have to do a lot more research. Um, pull them out, really look at them, and try to compare mm -hmm. because there's different models for different car styles. But the the style that I did find, um, they're averaging about two hundred and nineteen dollars. Yeah. So wow. I don't think we're gonna get that much for this. Obviously. No. Um. Yeah, I mean, I think we will be able to find this because this is a distinct pattern and it looks like a lot of the ones on here are very distinct patterns. So, I mean, if if we can find the exact match, we will try to sell it on eBay uh, for $150 to $200, somewhere around in there, profit at least $100. If we can't find the right match, then it could be zero dollars. Best case scenario, if we can't find a match, we sell it out front for like fifty bucks, and somebody can can uh, get a great deal. Great deal. Great deal. Let me get this box. Look, it's oh, this is so heavy. I bet this is a car part. Rotor. Oh my gosh. Which it could be worthless if uh, we don't know exactly which kind of vehicle it goes to. Right. Let's see. But, oh, there's a UPC. Are there is are this are this is on there? Yeah, AC Delco. I'm going to open it because it could be return fraud because it has been opened before. It's dirty. I don't want to touch it. Can you pull it out? <laughs> I mean, it looks nice. Yeah, it has not been used. If it had used, it would be all worn around in here. And uh, it looks good. So brand new, this is selling on Amazon for $73. Awesome. So that's like a $30 shipping item. We'll try and sell it on eBay for like $69.99, make around $30 shipping or $30 after shipping fees. I like it. Hop up. Ooh, you're gonna get the big box? It says Sun Joe. It's made for you. Oh. And it's got a UPC on it. Gotta love it when that happens. And they're right. Here, how about I There's you that. open? This is weird. Uh, it's like two boxes in one. They have Sun Joes and Sun I don't even know what I'm looking for. Well, it looks like a Sun Joe. Woo! It's a sprayer? Pressure washer. That looks used. extremely used. Pressure washer. It's an electric pressure washer? Is it like? Uh, yeah, electric high pressure washer. Cleans cars, fences, patios. All right. Man, that's a long cable. Dang. It's a big jumble of mess. I mean, you got water dripping everywhere from that wand. Yeah. So. Ah. Turn it around so they can see. I mean, you if you look at it, I mean, there's it's dirty. 
Yeah. Uh, so it's definitely going to be used. Now, a brand new one. This is not the extreme. I think it's just the regular. Let me look. Yeah. So this it's is like just it's... the regular. So it's it sells brand new for one fifty nine. All right. Um, but we're obviously not going to get that. But it is the time of year that people would be pressure washing. It is. Um, so as long as it works. And it's something we can test. $150 brand new. I mean, $75 as long as it works. It looks yeah. like it has all the stuff with it. Um, so I need to clean something. So I'll test it out while trying to clean something. Please. What are you doing? This is off the pallet. Oh, it's my turn. I wanted to test out the uh, scooter. It works. We have a case of uh, paper towels, babe. Well, yeah, but we also have a scooter. It, it's a pretty cool little scooter. Is that a mongoose? Yeah. I don't know how much it's worth, though, but I don't see. I was looking sweet. for a UPC is really what I was trying to do. And it's already put together, so that's even better. Wee. <laughs> Wee. 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 The up when I scanned it. <laughs> uh, brand new, one twenty nine ninety nine. Sweet. And uh, the tires don't really show any wear on this thing, which is good. It's already put together. I don't really see any scuffing on the side of the no, handlebars. It's a great, great little thing. So, uh, you know, this may be something we may be able to price it for like $100 mm -hmm. and get anything over $80. Yeah. Uh, so we'll say $80 for this, but we'll try and get $100. Ooh, paper towels. Yeah, so tape, paper Ooh. towels. Uh, we'll probably end up keeping them here for the shop because uh, we need some. Uh, but if we were to sell it, we tr we would try to get ten dollars for it, which I think we would get ten bucks for this easily, easily. I mean, because you got to think how much paper towels actually cost, and that's like how many of that? Like I know. Uh, I don't know how many's in there. A lot. A lot. And this is one of them inconspicuous boxes. What could it be? Ooh, so exciting! Well, Maybe a gender reveal? Yeah. Cut set. And they were having a boy and girl, or? No, or maybe it was a gender reveal, so nobody knows, so they yeah. had both. Oh, is that what they do? I think so. I have no idea. It's like, boy or girl, yeah. or he or she, what could it be? And then they have both, and then you vote. I gotcha. We'll put this out front. Uh, I feel like all of these supplies, uh, I don't five know. Five bucks. Five bucks. I mean, I'd say I think it's 10, but I mean, we'll probably try and sell for five. Well, you just gotta think, you know, you go to the dollar store, you can get these for a dollar. Ah, you can, you can't know? you? So, so we'll set it as a set, five bucks. Definitely like a return. It does say, Invacare, yes, you can. Okay. What is it, Joe? Looks like uh, for a uh, wheelchair. Oh, the see the the steps. No. Yeah. The foot the footrest. Yeah, the footrest steps thing. That's what it looks like. I think it is. Maybe not for a wheelchair, but then some something like medical device. It looks like, it's like a, a wheelchair. wheelchair. Yeah, because yeah. this would strap onto it or not strap on. And then on, this would but, be like a leg. Yep. Yeah pad it's backwards but i think it adjusts and yeah. i just don't know how to do it i think they put it on wrong oh looks like invacare wheelchair Maybe elevating well. leg rest uh 5289 okay so this is gonna be an item it's gonna be hard to sell locally for this we will try and sell it on ebay for 49.99 uh hopes to make around 20 dollars profit after shipping a piece dhl yeah i'll grab that one on I'm not trying to do more, but fine. this is not really, you know, it's like a little baby play thingy. I mean, we've had those before. We've sold them for like 10 bucks. Yeah. They sold pretty quickly on Facebook Marketplace. Yeah. So it, if it's good, that's probably what we'll sell that one for. Yeah. But this one is a mystery. It's a mystery. I was going to let you do it, but then you didn't grab. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. I was excited. I was waiting for it to open. Yeah. It's a mystery. Be nice if it's really expensive mystery. Like that one like Asus uh, portable laptop monitor that we got out oh, of a box yeah. similar to this. Well, that's not what this is. No, that's a projector. That's exactly what this is. But no, is there any? Okay. There's now, the cord. Got a cord and remote. And it looks to be gently used. 
not gently. I say it's in good condition. Yeah. Optima. There's a regulatory number, a serial number, and a manufacturer's number. Optima. Try two zero two one zero one. No way. No. Holy. S no, that's not. Look at it. Look at it. Yeah, but there's a lot that are very, very similar. And they're all like over a thousand dollars. No. Look at it. Stop. <laughs> Shush. I'm trying to think. Surely not. No, 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 no. <laughs> stop, stop, stop. Don't get excited yet. I mean, we don't even know if it works. Hold up. Let me try something real quick. Honestly, like I always tell people like not to get emotionally involved in inventory, oh. right? When it comes in. But like my my head is spinning right yeah. now. Like my so like move my, out the way. My chin. So, Here, let me turn the light off. Yeah. So you can see up there, it works. The cart's moving. Yeah. But this thing works. And Okay. Regardless of how much which model this is, this is the most expensive item that we have ever unboxed. Ever. That we're gonna be able to sell for what it's selling for. <laughs> so here's the deal. Here's the deal. There I can't give you an exact number of what this thing was gonna be worth because there are three there are three different models. The model numbers are are slightly different, but they're ranging anywhere from uh, like $900 on the low end to $1,400 on the high end. Um, and even if this was used, the resell value doesn't change very much. I mean, yeah. at minimum, they're selling for six to $700 on eBay. Yeah, for the lower end model. For the lower end it's, model. It has sold, many have sold for over $700 for the lower end model. The right. higher end model, it's selling for around $1,100 yeah. in used condition. So like, you know, there's this part of me that's like, I really want to not get emotionally involved in product, but like, this is like an extreme right now. I am yeah. tripping. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah. So we're going to do some more inspecting uh, when we go to list it. We're going to say for this purposes of uh, this unboxing video uh, that on the low end, we'll say $700 profit. <laughs> but it could be as much as a thousand dollar profit. Uh, we just don't know yet, but uh, to follow this story along, you're gonna wanna check out our other YouTube channel. It's called The Life with Joe and Jess. It's where we kind of go through our lives as resellers, as business owners. Um, so yeah, uh, we're gonna take a minute, come down off this uh, high before we continue. That's crazy. Yeah. Like I even called it, remember? Cause I'm like, Remember the Asus thing? The last time we unboxed something that like that was in a box like this, it was like something really awesome. And then this turns out to be four times more awesome than that. Do you want to go ahead and grab something for you? Yeah, let's do that. Oh, here you go, baby. Oh, you grabbed me the Windex. <laughs> I mean, I'm not the only one that I grab you, <laughs> but it is a gallon size at least. I mean, there's four of them in here. <laughs> And that's what it is. Windex, four of them, four big bottles. I didn't know what a gallon. I mean, I'm not, we're not going to sell this online. We're going to try and sell this locally uh, in so our heavy. store. But I guess each one, there we go. I'm just curious to see what a gallon of uh, Windex goes for these days. <laughs> I was trying to scan uh, stuff that I'm not familiar with just so that I can get an idea in the future. All right, 1431 for that, a gallon of okay, Windex. That makes so sense. easily we can sell these for five bucks a piece out in the shop. <laughs> and we'll do it. Oh gosh. Is that a car seat? That is a car seat. I saw it a minute ago. That brand, but this brand, I could be wrong, but Diana, I feel like I've- It's got a UPC. How about you open up or you can scan, you, yeah. I'll open it up. 
not like it's got all of the it's completely packed up yeah. and we'll pull it out and double check for sure it's so pretty but man. it looks good that is a nice looking yeah. car seat oh yeah it's got the tag it's still stuck on there it's clean this is best case scenario so best case scenario we pulled this out it's still completely clean we can sell this the jet black is selling for one ninety nine ninety two hundred bucks two hundred dollars. Wow! Uh, on Amazon, brand new. I knew this brand was good. Yeah. Um, they've got really good uh, ratings too. I'm okay. a stickler for car seat safety, so I will not sell it unless I'm absolutely sure that this has not been used before. Yeah. Um, but someone's about to get a really great deal on an awesome yeah. car seat. Yeah. It looks can... like they uh they returned it because of the box damage here which i can understand that yeah. I can understand. if you're gonna spend that kind of money yeah. on a car seat you're gonna want a good box um it could also be a shelf pull this could have been something that was on the shelf you know fork lip or yeah. something and and crushed it so that's also a possibility um so yeah okay so if we were to sell this how much would we make on that so i'm thinking we're gonna try and sell on facebook marketplace 150 bucks we'll charge shipping if somebody wants to pay for it uh anything over 130 dollars i would take yeah i'm good with that cellular, cellular shades. shades these three are the same they've got the same uh it's model probably like a little uh little thing that goes in the in the window so they're like those pull down shades uh, okay yeah. yeah pull down shades white uh they're going for 3147 on amazon 30 by 64 inch all three of them so uh maybe we can bundle them up um uh, we'll try and sell them locally just because it's shipping cost but we'll also sell them online um uh, if we can get 15 dollars profit per i think that would be good yeah all right we'll do that and let's move on to these over here no. i feel you know what it feels like are it like those bug shields or the wind protectors that go on the windows ah uh. you know it says driver and passenger so i'm thinking it's those like wind shields that you put over so that you can open the window or crack the window when it's raining or these are uh windshield wipers oh, okay yeah and uh they're selling for 42 dollars for a set okay. all right so there's only one in there which is not the best thing for us they're only selling for 24 dollars uh online if we're to sell it online we may make five dollars all right what's that it's heavy Yeah. <laughs> okay, go bring those up front. I'll okay. be up in a minute. We get asked a lot in live videos, you know, how do we do this with kids? Sometimes we don't. Mm -hmm. um, kids just have a way of stopping mm -hmm. everything you're doing. <laughs> this is another car part. It's got a UPC you if you want to scan it. When we first started buying pallets, we got we were buying truckloads. We used to get so many car parts, and I hated getting them because they always uh, weren't the right car parts being returned. And if the ones were returned, then um, we didn't have any idea what they were because there was no information. Is this like a shock or something? It's a shock absorber. It looks to be a very used shock absorber. Y'all see that? Ew, gross. Too bad, because this was a $288. Wow. What do y'all think happened with this? Somebody... Tell us a story in the comments below, <laughs> what you thought happened. How about a uh, baby food maker? Mm. This doesn't have to be... I know they say it's a baby bread yeah. baby food maker, but it... I mean, I feel like it would work as like a food processor, too, you know? I'm still like all out of sorts. I know. Uh, I'm trying to focus. That protector. <laughs> I'm really trying to focus. We started off really weird in this unboxing in the beginning. That yeah. was so long ago. I don't know if you guys I feel remember like that. That was 10 years ago. That seems like so long ago. We have been on like a adventure. roller coaster adventure ride. Let's see. So the baby Brezza has not been used. Nice. Yeah, it's perfectly. Let me make sure. Yeah, it's got all the stuff in it, but you know, people could always put that back. So let's see. I mean, it smells. I don't think it, it's been used. Has it? Yeah, because it's got baby food. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. So that's used. Yeah. 
But it's still sellable if it, it works. Is. As long as it works, we'd have to plug it in and make sure, but... I'm confused why this is um, so expensive. <laughs> because it's baby food stuff. And it's glass. Yeah. All right. So the glass version, there are 29 for sale. And they are priced at the cheapest one in brand new condition, albeit is $198.97. And it's because it's the glass the glass version. Because we've had, did we have Baby Brezza before? The yeah. one that we had? And it was a plastic one, but this is glass. It's like heavy duty. I cannot. Okay, here we go. So this is going to be an item that we're going to try and sell on Facebook Marketplace for around the $60 range. I maybe even price it a little bit more since they are going for two hundred dollars on Amazon. All right, which one do you do next? Let's do the shark. The shark. <laughs> the shark. I hope this has not been used. I don't even know whose turn it is anymore. I don't know. We're just either. tag We're just teaming at this it. point. We're just doing it's like it my now. head's cut off. There we go. All right, so looking inside. It looks like it has uh, been used before. At least this one has. I don't know why they would just use this little part, but that part has been used. There's a lot of parts in there. It's very party. <laughs> I mean, it's used. It doesn't look to be used a whole lot, but it has been used. If all the parts in are in that. I mean, that's pretty gross. Yeah, that's pretty gross. Uh, that is pretty gross. <laughs> uh, I don't know what they were vacuuming. The rest of it didn't look all that used. Hopefully all the pieces are inside. Got another piece there. Can you grab that one? I don't know why I always get to take this stuff out of the box where there's like a thousand pieces. Oh, that's dusty. It's the NV356ES2. So this dude uh, is on sale right now All right. for $164. So it's a $200 some dollar vacuum Yeah, it's a, it's a $200 vacuum. Well, we... Uh, we cannot sell that for $200. No. And I don't even know how much use you could sell these for. Uh, you know... I mean, I don't even know it's really worth much right now. Yeah. You know, we'd have to do a lot of cleaning up. Maybe, best case scenario, it's clean 50 bucks. Yeah. Uh, but it go. is dusty. I mean, you can see the dust I that mean, came off. I mean, if it works and somebody right really needs a nice vacuum, I mean, and they're not willing to. Uh, I mean, honestly, personally, I think we should sell it as is for yeah. 50 bucks. All right. For 50 bucks, I'm not going to clean it. Yeah. You know, but I also know that if somebody wants a really nice vacuum cleaner and they're willing to clean it, I mean, yeah. I would, if I really wanted a nice vacuum cleaner like this, I'd I would clean, clean it, it for 50 bucks. Especially if I needed one. Yep. Um, how about a masticating juicer? <laughs> I feel like, just imagine, what would it be like if all of these items that were we've got were uh, brand not, new. not like heavily used or not used? And juicers, if this is used, it's going to be kind of awful because it's hard to clean them. Healthy Living Orfeld, O-R-F-E-L-D. ZM1513 Orfeld. Yeah, that's it right there. I'm not even seeing watermarks on this, babe. All right. Well, it is the number one best seller. And we're going to wait to uh, to sell this until after Amazon Prime Day. Because right now, it is, uh, it's normally $159.98. And it's on Prime Day deal right now for $87.49. So that's a great deal. Um, if we're to try and sell it now, I mean, we could probably get more than that after Amazon Prime deal because it's Prime Day now, uh, yesterday and today. So I don't know. I mean, this hasn't been used. Yeah, not used at all. It's electric. So I'm thinking at least a hundred dollar. Yeah. At least a hundred bucks. I mean, it's a hundred and sixty dollars normally brand new. So if we can get a hundred and twenty dollars for it. I'd be happy with that, but I'd be really happy a lot more, but I'd sell for a hundred bucks. Yeah. 
Aspa. You grab that antenna. Can you grab that? I'll grab this right here. And then let me do it. Okay. I'll just lodge that. I have an amplified outdoor HD TV antenna. That one's heavy duty. We just sold one the other day for 35 bucks. That looks like it there, except for, because uh, it looks like it has a little yeah. thing to go on the top. So I have found the white one. I haven't found the black one, but the white one that looks just like it, this one is actually, because of the design, this one's actually $109.99. So put on Facebook Marketplace, 75 bucks. Take anything over $60. I like it. What is that? A pet stain? I'll give you, that's the... Uh, Bissell Pet Stain Eraser box is heavily damaged right there. All right, so this is the uh, Bissell Pet Stain Eraser. We have inspected it. They kept the charging cord. Yeah. Uh, and it's so dirty. I don't even know if we're going to be able to sell it because we might have. I didn't know it worked. I thought I'd already pushed the button. <laughs> well, at least it works a little bit. Yeah. Um, and uh, it's it was actually brand new. It's $84.99. Brand new, 84 bucks. So maybe use, we'll have to check to see price comps. Maybe it's worth uh, ordering a little charging cable for it. Actually. I think it just takes a regular AC ad adapter, right? Looks like there's something broke off inside. Oh. Oh. I and mean, that's what it looks like. Now that I'm actually looking at the charging port. Charging port door will slide out if of the way when charging. So it's just a door that protects the uh, inside. Okay. So if you push it in. The door should open. Yeah. So that's just a protector for like keeping gunk out of it. Okay. So what we'll then do some further evaluation to see what we can actually sell it We're for. We're gonna call it zero for yep. now. Um, but if we can get a decent price out of this, we may just order a, a adapter and uh, and then sell it for maybe you know twenty bucks or so. I don't know. We'll see. Um, all right. So this is it's a, it has a crayola it does thing on it like stuck to the plastic is that wrapping paper oh is that just a box oh it is the box it's a table <laughs> that's the table right there oh i can see that it's like a little table that's the, the kind of table it is. but uh, It's a very cheap little table. Yeah. We don't know the brand, the dimensions. We know nothing about this. Um, is that like a little outdoor table? Yeah. You probably put little plants on it outdoors. Yeah. Even indoors. I mean, that's cute. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, I can't imagine this being worth more than a few dollars. Uh, we can call it 10 bucks. If you yeah. Put it, front, put it together or something, sell it All for right. 10 bucks. Somebody will love a little people. They will. I mean, it's not heavy duty either, you yeah. know? I mean, it's not messed up or anything, but it, it, I mean, you can't put a lot of weight on this. And no. It's not, it's very much decorative. But 10 bucks would be a good deal. Yeah. All right, so we've got two items, and this one that we're not unboxing right now, it looks really super interesting. This is a chair, an office chair, maybe a gaming chair, but the box has uh, been damaged. And, and I can see uh, like a foot in the box that has been definitely damaged. So this is not gonna be like a new, brand new item. But that's, that's a white gaming chair, that's sweet. I mean, somebody may, may but, clean it up. Okay, so that's the leg base there, the bottom leg base, where all the wheels go. That's so what that is damaged. So you wouldn't even really see it. So it's Felix King. If I can, we can find a, there's a model number. Felix King. This kind of excites me. The reason being is because we have gotten, we have got, we have gotten in. Yep, that's it. Uh, we have unboxed, that I like that one better, a white gaming chair in the past, and it sold within an hour. Granted, that was a couple years ago before Christmas. It may be different terms now, but ah, it's exciting. Yeah. All right, so this chair right here is $139.99 brand new. 140 bucks brand new. So, so I'm thinking we put it together, sell it for a hundred dollars. Yep. Assuming all the parts are yeah. there and everything. The last item. I think and I babe, I think I recognize this uh I know I recognize this logo and uh I'm kind of excited about what this could be. I think that's an iRobot. 
Do you want to look it up and me open or me me look it up and you open? Uh, which one do you want to do? I can look it up. I guess I've got the right. one here. You got that? I guess it's right there. I'm excited about this, y'all. Let's just hope it's not like completely I know. Apart. Maybe I shouldn't be excited because uh, everything that we've, like a lot of the uh, bigger expensive items that we've got off this one, the items have been damaged. And that's what it is. I robot root I7 plus. Holy cow, this is like seven or eight hundred dollars. It is an eight hundred dollar iRobot. There's no way. Hold up. Hold up. Don't panic. No, because I just saw Stop. somebody. Don't panic. Inspect it already. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It's got the station. Yeah, but what if and it's everything. broken? It's obviously been taken out because look. I see that. All right. So there's the vacuum. We'll look at it. That's like the station. <gasps> it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's, I think it's been run a couple of times. It's a little I dusty. think it's been ran. But, uh, I mean, it's it's been used. I mean, this is clean. Yeah. Like, if they ran it, they didn't run it, like, a long time. It obviously, it's charged. <laughs> I am freaking out right now. so pretty it looks good y'all know what the crazy thing is um the crazy thing right wow, it's all right here, my is uh i'm getting kind of emotional right because we needed a new vacuum cleaner and a new robot vacuum cleaner and uh, they're on the same pallet. A pallet that the one item pays for the entire pallet. And. <laughs> I mean, if it works, you know. <laughs> it's the. I wanted a shark <laughs> vacuum cleaner for here at the shop. Because we have a little rinky dink vacuum cleaner that we've had for three years that it's it doesn't suck it sucks at sucking it no longer sucks <laughs> and for that reason it sucks <laughs> and our robot vacuum cleaner we used it so much that it no longer sucks <laughs> either so it's like do we keep it you know um, or do we sell it and get something i know it's like, you know what I mean? So let's look We're going to assume that we're going to sell it, though. Let's I look at prices to see what a used iRobot 7 is selling for. And that one's got a UPC on it. But this is an i7 Plus. That is crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> Nobody's selling used. They're selling parts only. Two fifty dollars for a pre-owned. Okay. Uh, there was another one that's pre-owned that was selling that sold for 500 so 500 dollars 435 plus 52 dollars that's almost 500 yeah uh 250 it's either 250 or 500 and so this would actually would be, yeah yeah so this one we could sell for 500 bucks so on the low end that would give us 400 dollars profit yeah <laughs> oh my gosh this palette is i don't know if i can handle anymore i'm glad the palette is over honestly because i don't even know how much more i can handle Okay, we're going to take a breather. We're going to put yeah. all the costs together. and we. Y'all will... probably already know the totals. We don't. Yeah. But we... y'all are watching it. You know, y'all know exactly how much we've done right now. Here in just a second, you'll know that we also know. <laughs> so, <laughs> that, was, that was crazy. It's been like an hour since we actually unboxed the last we've item. We've had to process yeah. quite a bit. But $1,775. You guys have been seeing it the whole unboxing. We just found out not too long ago 
that uh, we tripled our money. Uh, and this is what we should get after, you know, granted, we still have employees to pay. We still have overhead to pay. That's just after shipping the fees. Crazy money. The fourth pallet, definitely, we are definitely going to be trying wholesale logistics more uh, because all four pallets were really good pallets. All of them had some high dollar stuff. All of them had some broken stuff, which is expected. It's Amazon customer returns. Uh, and I'm still trying to process what happened. Yeah. Uh, so we hope that you guys have enjoyed this unboxing. We thank you guys so much. Uh, we really enjoyed filming this one. Heck yeah. We had to take a few breaks in between just to be able to get our bearings back. Yeah. Um, but if you're interested in following what happens after the unboxing, make sure you subscribe to our other channel as well, Life with Joe and Jets. There's a link in the description yeah. down below. Until next time, friends. Peace. peace.